Crazy Talk Animator brings a whole new 3D experience to the world of 2D animation. However, with three different versions, you might be wondering which one is most suitable for you. For those of you who lack an animation background and who enjoy quick and easy production of presentations, training videos, or web marketing videos, the standard version is just what you need. If you have some basic animation skill and would like to modify your character's look and motions, the Pro version is here for you with full 3D motion editing functionality. Lastly, for those of you who love to design original characters using drawing tools like Flash, or if you're interested in applying 3D motions from iClone or other 3D tools into Crazy Talk Animator 2, the Pipeline version is definitely your choice. Let's take a look at some of the features in these three versions. In the standard version, there are several embedded characters with lots of facial and body sprites you can mix and match to produce custom looks. The Pro version lets you take this a step further by providing the ability to replace any body part with an image. This allows you to create fun custom characters like Fruit and Veggie Frankenstein and his pal Ted here. In the Pro version, you can also access the Runtime Composer, which allows you to add additional images to a single dimension character that requires an additional sprite angle for a particular motion. In Crazy Talk Animator, users can apply different render styles by selecting templates. In the Pro version, users will have the ability to customize color schemes in more detail. This way, users can mix and match various color themes for dramatic effect. In the standard version, you can select simple puppet profiles to produce instant animation for different situations. The Pro version lets you further modify the motions for unlimited possibilities from a single base motion. In the standard version, there are tons of embedded 2D motions with selective angles for you to apply. With a few clicks, you will have instant 2D animation in a variety of angles. The Pro version includes embedded 3D motions, which allow you to freely change the angle profile of your character while it maintains the same animation. You can also edit the motions in a 3D environment with the Human IK system. The Clip Auto Extend function allows you to extend clips and blend them into any keyed position for continuous performance. The Pinning feature allows you to lock selected body parts to create natural motions using Human IK. In the standard version, you can do basic timeline editing, such as setting basic 2D motion keys for body transform, sprite switch, and layer order. The Pro version enables users with full timeline functions such as copy, paste, move key, clip loop, and speed control. You'll also find an additional track for 3D motion, which allows you to access the track for 3D angle and motion layers. For both 2D and 3D motions, there are separate timeline sections that provide a clear way to organize your motion editing. There is also a collect clip track for you to select and save custom motion clips. The Pro version also allows you to do advanced motion editing, such as time warp, transition curve, and motion alignment. The motion curve helps you ease in and out of an animation clip while the Time Warp helps you create an ease in and out effect within the motion clip itself. The Align feature allows you to select any body part and set it as the root for your motion by causing the rest of your body to align with it. You can also anchor the position of any body part to a particular location for flawless transition between different motions. The Pipeline version includes all of this and more, including powerful features that provide a smooth workflow with other programs. Pipeline users will receive a character production template and can simply replace the body parts to generate their own custom characters. Then it's just a single click to import into CTA2. After that, simply check the calibration of your character to apply any refinements. Pipeline users also have the ability to customize their render styles in more detail as well. Simply assign each body part to a color group and modify all the elements of each group simultaneously. The Pipeline version also allows iClone users to import 3D motions from the iClone library, which means that current iClone users will now have a massive library of motions to use in CTA2. And it's not limited to iClone motions either. With 3D Exchange, you can literally import any 3D motion out there, whether it be mocap data or files from an online marketplace. 
there are now infinite possibilities for your 2D character animation. So now that you've been introduced to all three editions, it's time to take your pick and start your adventure into a whole new style of 2D animation.